Hey guys, it's Paul from paulnigeria.com. I just want to intro my holiday blog. Uh, it might be too late for the Christmas season, but it's okay. I wanted to just get the message out and just share a little philosophy, Paul Niger insight for you. Uh, before I get to that, I wanted to talk about my book. My book is available on my website, paulniger.com, or my author website, authorpaulniger.com, N-I-J-A-R.com. It's a spirituality, self-help, meditation book that helps you identify the lessons that are seated deep within our emotional struggles that we go through, through different intensities of our lives. Um, ang anger, anxiety, depression, frustration, all these different emotions that we go through, there's a lesson within each one. Unless you're able to identify the lesson, you need to keep going through it like you're failing a course in school. So. You you want to graduate through each one so you may further evolve and ascend in your spiritual journey in this life. So check it out on my website for the e-copy, paulniger.com, or if you want a hard copy, you can check it out at author, paulniger.com, N-I-J-A-R. Uh, so go to my blog about this Christmas season, the holiday season, or whatever you want to call it. It's the time of the year that we want to uh, spend time with our family, loving, sharing, uh, and just you know, just celebrating this, you know, the last month of the year, you know, we're coming to the end and the new year's couldn't start. But a lot of the times we find ourselves full of anxiety, anger, even sadness, because a lot of people don't have, they watch other people celebrating this and that, and they may feel left out and they might feel, you know, a little depressed. But the other people that are full of a lot of family, they might be stressed. You know, there's so much going on, you know, like they have to work. If you're working in retail, you're working overtime. You know, because you're trying to keep up with the demand. The consumers are coming in. You want to have all the products. You want to be there to present them to them. You want to make sales. You want to get your numbers up. Make that money. And all in the hopes that we can make money and so we can buy more gifts and give it to the people we love. But at what point did we decide that money is what defines our love? Like, why is it that it takes us to buy something for someone and wrap it up in a nice gift and put it under a tree for them to unwrap it? And they're like, hey, you love me. You bought me this thing. It, it says Nike on it. Or it says... PlayStation or it says whatever you know it's like buying a card that says something beautiful because you weren't able to say it yourself you know like it's, it's a great idea to share and you know spend money your hard earned money for someone but wouldn't it be better just to have your love intention into what you're doing and present what you're doing as a gift to them you know whether you're cooking a, a nice dinner for someone you love or you're making a gift knitting a sweater uh, making jewelry different models or whatever whatever it is if you can't if you don't, or painting a picture, you know, if you're not um, artistically inclined, you don't feel like that you're creative enough, then, you know, use this time to spend time putting up the, uh, the lights outside the house, decorating the house, or, you know, just coming up with a yearly plan. How, how are you gonna plan this year? Do this together as a family. Do it together as a group with the people that you love, that you love to spend time with, rather than going to work and thinking that you have to work extra hours, or rather thinking that you have to spend all this money and race through the mall and try to get the the parking spot and you know putting yourself in debt maxing out your credit card and starting the year off in debt and spending the rest of the year trying to have to pay it off so I'd rather just see a lot more people being happy and sharing love and being love you know um, just a quick blog I just wanted to intro it's on my website paulniger.com and if you want to check out my book it's there also or you can check out it out on author paulniger.com author paulniger.com See ya, happy holidays.